Hey, Ash, can you come down here for a minute? I'm trying to get the basement organized, and I've come across several items that we're not using anymore. Now that the Pinners Conference is over, I feel like I can finally organize our new rental house. We have this huge basement, but half the space is taken up by old baby things. Oh my gosh, they used to sleep in these. That was their first bed. Like, look at how tiny that is. It's special memories. Do you think you can part with some of this stuff? I don't know, I don't think so. I totally understand that, but we're not using it, and unfortunately, we're probably not going to use it. It's just hard to think that, like, we're done. Like, that's what giving this stuff up means to me. It's like, that's it. We're done. Like, the baby phase is over. Like, it's gone. We tried for so many years to have babies, and here we are just getting rid of their things. It's still really difficult to officially close that chapter in our lives. It's like saying goodbye to the baby phase forever. It's hard because I feel like it kind of brings up those past, like, infertility feelings. I mean, I have my four miracle babies, but you still feel those feelings. You still feel, you know, the pain of infertility. I don't think that ever goes away. I mean, I can't have any more kids. I know. I think that's what makes it the hardest. These are our, our very first children, and they're probably our very last. <laughs> Infertility was definitely one of the hardest things that we ever had to go through. But at the same time, we know that there was a reason for that struggle, because we have these four beautiful miracles now, and those struggles really shaped who we are as people. Life threw 10 curveballs at you, and it's not anything close to what you expected. <laughs> but at the same time, it's so much better. Isn't it so much better? It's better than anything we ever dreamed <laughs> of for ourselves. <laughs> just makes me feel so, just so blessed that with what we've been given, 